Hello YouTubers, it's only me. It is Tuesday the 30th, yeah, 31st of May 2022. Uh, this may be the last vlog I'm going to do until after the Jubilee thing. So yeah, this is the last vlog I'm going to do for the time being until after the uh, Jubilee. But I've got a bit of a uh, update, so hopefully, um, hopefully I'll be able to vlog for about 20 minutes or so. Hopefully no longer than 20 minutes, but hey ho, but just to let you know. So, the updates. Quickly cross them. I smell chips. <laughs> no, that's not one of the updates, but I can actually smell chips. I'm like, mm, chips. Um, which is quite unusual. Don't know what that was, but hey ho. Um, anyway. So, I've got a few updates. Update number one. The thing that I've signed up for, I paid it in full. So, my booking has been confirmed and it's locked in for August the 8th. I'm still not going to tell you what I've applied for, but it is good. So, it's something I've chosen and yeah so I thought yeah why not uh, the only people who know is my mum my dad my grandma because I told her last night uh, over on messenger and a few of my carers I haven't told you guys and I haven't even told Spectrum so there's a reason for that so, not to go into too much detail. So that's update number one. Number two, uh, me and my mum have got our outfits ready for the uh, Queen's Jubilee, or the Platinum Jubilee, um, for the club on Saturday. My mum's got, my mum's came first. It, it's this Union Jack dress because it's slightly short she's gonna hopefully find some silver leggings to go with it so that'd be cool and I've got a Union Jack jacket with the tie so I've, I've got that so I'm thinking of wearing that with um, my red shirt and Possibly even my blue shorts that I haven't worn. I mean, I've tried it on, but I haven't actually worn it yet. Um, or my blue pants. But there'll be smart pants and smart shorts. With obviously smart shoes. If I wore the pants, I'd just um, have what I call um, my uh, just normal socks. What we call normal these days. Plain socks. I mean, plain socks. Um, if shorts, then I could possibly wear my white socks with the red and blue stripe. So they're the two possibilities that I've got. Well, that's the first time I've seen a 35 as a double decker. I'm like, okay. Normally a 35 is always a single decker, but never mind. Sorry, I'm just looking at buses at the moment and cars as usual while I was talking to you guys. So that's update number two that we got our outfits ready for Saturday. Um, update number three. Spectrum has been invited to be in a film with the Newcastle University and it's to do with basketball and involving people with 
disabilities, or should I say, special powers. Um, um, and it's a paid thing. So, get involved in having dialogue, you get paid a hundred. Get, getting involved, but no dialogue, that's 70. And obviously I chose the dialogue version. Not because there's more, but I get paid more money. It's because, for me, as an actor, I like having dialogue. I know a lot of actors, like Rowan Atkinson and that, uh, they had barely any dialogue. Um, like, for example, Rowan Atkinson, uh, when he was Mr. Bean, um, he didn't really have a lot of dialogue. But I'm one of those who likes to have dialogue. So, yeah, obviously I chose that. Maybe one day I might explore my non-dialogue self, but nowadays, uh, acting is about dialogue. Having a script. And expressing emotions through words. There's not really a lot what you call silent films or non dialogue films. There's not really a lot of them nowadays, so that's why I chose that. And plus, I'm a chatterbox in real life, so that kind of clarifies it. So that's the third update. I don't know when we're going to do that. They said it Thursday gone. But I can't remember what day it's going to be. Or day. I keep thinking it's going to be a Tuesday. Don't know why, but it's going to be a Tuesday. Obviously not today, but a Tuesday. Um, so, got that to look forward to. I mean, a, a few of us are like, oh, we'll do that, we'll have a bit of dialogue. A few of us, they're like, uh, actually, I still like to be involved, but I like to be on the outskirts, as in um, backstage or something like that, which is totally fine as well, because it's building that confidence uh, after, in a roundabout way, the hell we had for two years. Yeah, the bee just went through us. I was like, well. So yeah, so we're involved in doing that. Uh, the other update on the twenty. 20- 3rd of June, if I'm remembering this date correctly, we're going to do our first workshop to do with the poetry thing, and we're going to be at the library. This is to do a spectrum as well. And our workshop is actually called Listen Up, which is actually one of the titles I came up with. We had other titles, but they chose one of my titles, uh, Listen Up. I don't know. They just found out maybe, oh, actually, I like that. Listen up. So, I'm kind of glad that was uh, the title. Because I just thought of it thinking, listen up, would that be a good title? And it turned out to be a great title. I was like, okay, <laughs> no worries. Love it. I love, I love having ideas, thinking, oh, that would be a good title. That would be a good title. Uh, two seconds, I need to do my lace. There you go. The reason I'm vlogging at the moment is because I haven't got any carers. I haven't had carers for now three days. Normally I don't have any carers on a Monday. Um, but I did say I would want them back on a Monday since I'm not doing health fair. Um, but never mind. And then like, they apologise Sunday 
that they couldn't cover for us. So, gave us 50 quid. I don't know what I'm going to spend that on. Maybe part of that might go towards the club. Who knows? We'll say. We'll see, we'll see. Um, have I got any other updates? Uh, no, but I've got plans in the f- future. Two seconds. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, so yeah, I've got plans in the future. Uh, I'm going to try and do this in order. So, so everyone knows about uh, August the 8th. I just haven't told you specifically what's happening on August the 8th. So you know about that. So what? I'm going to try my myself. I'm going to try my best not to repeat myself. I hope. Um, so the plans are for for, have we got any plans in June well apart from um, uh, Spectrum doing the workshop thing I don't think I've got any plans in June, but July, that's a big beat, uh, in July, um, so 22nd of July, I think, yeah, 22nd of July, me and my mum will be going to Pride, and we're both going to be dressed as the same person, but different versions that's all I like to say is um, the same person but different versions <laughs> so that's kind of cool I'm actually looking forward to Pride haven't been to Pride since 2019 if I recall correctly because I was calf last time which was fun so it's calf uh, that year uh, I thought there was going to be another pride last year there kind of was but there wasn't it was more of an online thing so I didn't join up for that one it didn't seem the same so because it's actually fully back in person definitely going like I said it's with my mom so we're going to be the same person just different versions no I'm not going to be cast before you even go there what I mean by different versions but the same person I'm trying not to give too much away but hey ho, we're gonna be yeah. Um I'm gonna try not to give too much away. If I tell you that, it would definitely Yeah. Anyways, moving on. So that's one plan. The second plan is near my mum's birthday, which is the 30th of July, or on her birthday. Where I'm thinking now, I know I was going to wait for a year, but I'm thinking now to get a second tattoo done, the Wonder Woman, ta- uh, the Wonder Woman uh, symbol to represent my mom. Now, at first, I don't know if you were, if I, if I told everyone this, but I was going to have a band around, and I was told it was going to hurt. Uh, And then I was told it would be worth it if I did that. And then I looked at the logo again. And I thought, 
right, actually, no, I like it like that instead. So instead of a band, I just have the actual logo. Because the other image I had, the other image that I got from Google, it looked like a band with the Wonder Woman symbol. I thought, that'll look cool. And then when I looked at it again, well, not that specific picture, but a different picture, um, and it was a logo by itself. I thought, actually, no, I have the, I just have the logo. So that's what I went for. Well, that's what I'm going to go for. It's going to be so big, gold, and this was my mum's idea to go to the tattooist and ask ask them for a rough estimate. How much this is going to be? Normally, now it has a ten. They'll probably be like, "Oh, it's 200, 300 quid." And if I've got that, I can do that, no problem. If not, I go. Oh, sorry, I haven't got that with me today. But um, I will come back at such and such a date. So that's the plan. And that means I have to wait longer for the vampires. I was going to do the vampires this year, but it looks like I'm going to be doing it next year. Because I'm still, at the moment, even though the restrictions have lifted and masks are not a priority, but I've still got that, like, got a saying in my head saying, oh, we do not accept exemptions. So... So I'm going to let this year fly by and then go to the vampires next year because we're going to the, um, the NHSBT, I think it's called, uh, app. If I had any tattoo, um, if I had a tattoo, piercing or, well, anything to do with piercing in the skin I have to wait four months uh, until I'm actually you know accepted you know donate blood so because of this first tattoo it would have led up to September the 6th to my knowledge but normally I might add an extra week just to be on the safe side but now I'm thinking of a second tattoo, which would be hopefully this year in July. It will be July, August, September, October, November. It'll be up to November. The next time I'll do that. So that way I'll be like, mm, no, I don't want to donate blood in November. I want to do it next year. So that's what I thought of. I was going to have the second tattoo next year, but I'm kind of like, oh, I like to have two tattoos. I want to even it out. So, and then have a break until I think of any more tattoos. Because at the moment I'm thinking seven more. Well, it'll be six more after the second one. So I'm like, oh my God, where to put them? Because at first I had this vision in my head, like where to put them. And now because obviously it's permanent, I'm like, um, where will I put them? So I have to double think where to put them. So that's the plan. And the other plan is hopefully good to the Hoppins, which is like, um, like end of July, beginning of August. So that'd be fun. Uh, and we've got a question mark into going to Canterbury at the end of August for Grandma's birthday. So we've got a question mark because of him. So we're kind of like, do we, don't we? And we've literally got a few people in mind who would, um, you know, look after Hooch and others we can't really trust. So... But that's the full throttle. Um, anyways, uh, that's my life, I guess. <laughs> anyways, 
Pray today, YouTubers. Live long and prosper. And I'll see you. I don't know when, but after the Jubilee thing. Bye.